Hey, thank you so much for being here. Today, I'm going to show you one of my all-time favorite blocks in Alteryx, the Tile Block. So what this allows you to do is it allows you to essentially go in and start to group all your different records based off the values of a particular column. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop uh, this tile block in. And so the first thing you'll notice is that there's a bunch of different methods that you can actually use to perform your, your tiling. In this example, we are going to use a smart tile method, which essentially takes the standard deviation of a column and then ranks each row uh, depending on how far away it is from that average. So that's the example we'll be focusing on today, um, but I will leave a link in the description so that you can go in and see the different methods and start to understand how they work. So we'll go ahead and select Smart Tile, and we'll also select uh, to output the long column name as this is going to help us to understand why each individual record was placed where it has been. Uh, finally, all we need to do is say the column that we want to use. So we're going to go ahead and take this total column uh, and let's hit Run and see what it gives us. There we go. Uh, and so what we can see here straight away is that this record has actually ranked high because it's two standard deviations away uh, from the average. All of these records down here are all uh, in the above average range and we can even see the different thresholds uh, that Alteryx has calculated for why it's in that range. Uh, and the further down we go, we'll then start to see our average, uh, below average uh, and extremely low as well. But what if we wanted to take it a little bit further and we wanted to start to group by the order type. So let's say, I want to understand what's average for a web order or what's average for a phone order. All we need to do then is actually go ahead and click on uh, the order type. So we'll go ahead and use that as a group by column. You can use more than one if you'd like to. We'll give it another run. And what Alteryx has done this time is it's now gone ahead and looked at all of the different records that fall within this phone category. And then it's gone in and given us all of the different tiles for just that phone orders. And it will then do the same thing for all of the install orders and so on. And so there you have it, just a couple of different options within the, the tile block. And you're very quickly able to remove the human element, remove the, the manual processing out of all of this, and just let Alteryx take care of that heavy lifting for you. Well, I hope this has been useful. Thank you so much for your time. And uh, yeah, happy solving. Cheers.